Today I'm rolling over to the 34th Street Wall where I'm meeting Megan Arthur, the Executive Director of Project Makeover. I'm learning about community service today and I am so excited about it. Hello! Megan, it's so nice to meet you. It's so nice to meet you. How are you doing? I'm good, how what? are you? Good, where are we right now? Okay, so we're at the 34th Street Wall and okay. we just wanted to come out and let the community know what we were doing. I love it, I mean this is, can I help out at all? Absolutely. Or? Do you think we could go on a bike ride? I, want, I really want to learn more about Project Makeover. I think it's a beautiful day for a bike ride. So <laughs> Let's do it. Why not? Let's do it. Let's do it. Oh, this is fun. I love it. This is so great. All right, Megan. So just tell me a little bit about yourself. What year are you? What, what are you studying? Where are you from? I am Megan. I'm from St. Augustine. Have you drinking from the Fountain of Youth? I have, in fact. I'm pretty sure it was tap water, but. <laughs> oh, wow. We're causing a traffic jam. We sure are. I guess we're just going to go for it. Thank you. I'll, I'll do the friendly wave. You know? Thank you so much. Thank you, Mr. Toyota. You're awesome. Thanks so much. Hong Kong, that's right. Wow. People are so friendly here at UF. I love, I love it. it. Honestly, that's why I came here. I came to visit my friend when I was. Um, in high school, she was a year older than me. I came and stayed with her and I was just like, wow, this place is so great. I met some of her friends and they were like really kind to me. And I thought, wow, I wanna go here. And then I did, and it's the best decision I've ever made. Well, thanks for going on this tandem ride across campus. I really appreciate you picking me up to do this. Like, this was great. You know, I haven't, I'm trying to see campus from different views and this is, and check one off the list, you know? So community service, mm -hmm. that's what you're doing. Yeah. What is your definition of community service? Yeah, so the term community service, I feel like sometimes gets kind of a cliche rap. It's kind of like, oh, you know, let me go pick up some paper by the road, which is important, don't litter. But, <laughs> you know, like to me, it's really looking like, okay, this is what our community is. Like, let's look at the community as a whole and see what we can do to fit in. What can we do to make it better? That's community service. What can you do to service? And what kind of mark are you making that's going to leave a positive impact? Like picking up paper on the ground. I important, yes. <laughs> or painting schools. Or painting schools. <laughs> what do you gain when you serve the community? I gain, honestly, just like, happy feelings. I know that sounds so, so like cliche, but I think the more positivity you're putting into things, the more you get out, and that comes back on the people that are putting that in. Honestly, everyone that's a part of it shares in that, and I think that's pretty cool. Kind of like that gator good. I kind of like that. It's like we go to UF or something, like with the, with the gator good. <laughs> yeah, that, that joy just kind of stays around. It sticks with it you. It does, for sure. I think positive emotions and positive feelings have a really, really impactful um, effect on anything. I mean, you're Oprah. I'm just the guy on Oprah. Maybe you're like Dr. Phil. I need, I need less hair. I need a shorter haircut. You need to be balding, really. So is he balding or did he just shave it? I'm pretty sure he's balding. Okay. You know, that's, that's one of those things with the older generation. They just tend to bald.